China has blocked a group of British lawmakers from entering Hong Kong. The MPs were planning to study the political and economic situation in the territory. So that the House should debate a, sp a specific and important matter that should have urgent consideration. Members of Britain's Foreign Affairs Committee were hoping to fly out on a fact-finding mission later this month. The visit would also mark the 30th anniversary of the signing of the Sino-British Joint Declaration. That document paved the way for Britain to hand Hong Kong back to China. But the Chinese embassy in London refused to issue visas. The committee chairperson says the Chinese government is acting in an overtly co confrontational manner. And this is the most worrying thing about this, is that they seem to be saying that the joint declaration now has no validity whatsoever. A Chinese foreign ministry spokesperson says it is China's sovereign right to decide who is allowed to enter Hong Kong. If the British lawmakers insist on trying to visit, we will consider the move an overt confrontation. The spokesperson said China told Britain many times that it opposes the trip. Now, the U.S. government has expressed concern over China's moves on the issue. We hope the members of parliament will be able to travel freely as they wish. Saki said the U.S. continues to urge protesters in Hong Kong to act in peace and the authorities to refrain from provocative actions.